At 5.30, everyone, as the temperatures go down, heaters are turning up out there, and sadly, that often means higher utility bills. Well, KUB working to help needy families keep the power on with Project Help. And joining us here in the studio, everyone, we have Tiffany Martin with KUB. So thank you so much for joining us today. Happy to be here. Glad to have you. Let's talk a little bit about Project Help for people who are not familiar with this. Absolutely. Project Help is a program that helps with emergency utility assistance or heating assistance. So for those families that are having difficulty heating their homes, those funds assist with electric Bills, mm -hmm. gas bills, wood purchases, coal purchases, anything you would heat your home with, those funds can go towards those. Anything you heat your home Absolutely. with. Absolutely. Oh, that is good to know. How many families have you guys helped? This year, up to date, we've helped about 450 families. This year alone? This year alone. So you can only imagine after the span of this program, hundreds, if not thousands, of Absolutely. families have been helped. Absolutely. And, and there are families just that are in need. They have an emergency situation occur, a loss of a job, a disability, something that makes it hard. For them to heat their home in the winter, and this program's there to help them with that. And this could happen to any one of us if something were to happen. Absolutely. So let's talk a little bit about on the bottom of your utility bill. You see that little box you can check? Yes. Is that part of Project Help? Absolutely. So the way to give to Project Help is you can do that one time on the back of your bill, or you can do a monthly recurring charge to, uh, with your bill payment. As well as you can just mail a check if you're not a KUB customer and don't have that on your back of your bill mm -hmm. scrub, you can mail something into the Project Help program. Now, you guys also have a big donation drive of some sort coming Absolutely. up? Absolutely. We do have a donation drive that starts on January 7th and runs through February 1st. And um, non customers or even customers can donate through Food City or Home Federal locations. And all those funds go directly to the Knoxville, Knox County Community Action Committee to support the program. So many people ask that. So, if I'm going to donate to something, is the money going to stay here? This is helping your neighbors. Absolutely. This is local funds, it helps your neighbors right in your neighborhood. It's not something being sent to another community. All right, Tiffany, a lot of people watching right now, they may be on the other side of this. They may need the assistance. Sure. How do they reach out and what are the qualifications? Absolutely. There's a variety of qualifications. The best way to know if you qualify is to contact the Knoxville, Knox County, County Community Action Committee. They can be contacted at 637-6700 and they'll go through a process to identify what things you might need and, and work with you to see if you qualify for any funds in the program. Well, Tiffany, on behalf of our community, thank you so much for, for doing Project Help. It's so important to so many people. We want to thank everybody that's donated up to date and that will donate in the future. We appreciate everyone helping their neighbors. Well, thank you so much for coming in today. Thank you for having us. And again, everyone, if you would like to help out or just learn more about applying for Project Help, just go to our website, WATE.com. Com. Look under the As Seen On section. We have all the information you need right there. Bo? All right, great program. Thank you so much, Kristen.